Following a convoluted and contentious candidate selection procedure prior to the August elections, the CCC opposition party is experiencing internal strife. Nelson Chamisa, the leader of the CCC, has tried to contain the effects of the procedure, which reportedly caused some prominent party members to lose their constituencies, including Vice President Tendai Peter. Critics claim that CCC's decision to only declare the top three favored candidates in each constituency rather than the outright winner was made to hide the defeats of influential party leaders and prevent party rifts. Chamisa avoided calling clear winners when questioned about the choice at a news conference, saying the announced candidates were the people's preferred options. He claimed that those who fell short would receive party positions. Yet, according to sources, Alan Markham defeated Beater for the Harare East seat and Eric Mirai lost the high field race. What would happen if Beater or Mirai failed to represent the party in elections was not made clear by CCC leaders. According to reports, incumbent lawmakers in several districts ran with opposition or even failed to make it out of the CCC candidate selection process. Job Jr., the son of Zanjiza West, top three candidates in Chitanguza, is an inmate job seeker. He supposedly lost against Innocence Viper and Darlington Muzonza in the end, though. The incumbent lawmaker, Andenai Tarasenga, was not even among the top three candidates in ST. Mary's constituency. Instead, the list included Brighton Mazendu, Hilary Kwata, and Freddie Messerer. Amos Jubaya, however, was nominated to represent CCC in Gueros Mkobat North District without any opposition. Kobon Metzevenika and Settlement Chikwinya, two prominent party figures, were selected as the top three contenders in the Mbaizo constituency. The opaque selection procedure was criticized by political commentators, who labeled it undemocratic and claimed it demonstrated Chumisa's type control over the party. They issued a warning that it might dilute CCC's electoral support, asserting that genuine candidates know themselves and that the official list will only be made public on nomination day. CCC officials like Felix Moffat defended the procedure. Several observers, however, believed that declaring numerous candidates was a hazardous move that might split the party. Before the vital elections, the CCC's reputation as an alternative to Zenu PF is threatened by the chaotic candidate selection, which reveals internal conflicts and a lack of openness. Whether the CCC can unite to oppose the ruling party's extended hold on power will depend on how Chamisa manages the dissatisfaction within his ranks.